Hi everyone, today we are going to check out a very cool electric bike from VV. Spec wise, this is probably the best band for the buck in the affordable e-bike market. It's equipped with a powerful 500 watt rear hub motor. The battery is 48 volt and the capacity is 13 AH. It's a 21 speed bike with 3 gears on the front and 7 gears on the rear. The handlebar is height and tilt adjustable, and it comes with front fork suspension and headlight. The tires are 26 inch and anti-punk trim. The top speed is 20 mph and I can easily get more than 30 miles on flat roads. The battery comes with the key lock for anti-theft and the control circuit is placed below the bike seat. Both the front and rear wheels feature disc brakes. The pedal assist control unit is on the left hand side. There are three levels to choose from and we can also set it to off. The button indicator shows the current battery level. Press and hold the minus key to start the walk mode, while holding the plus key to turn on off the headlight. This e-bike also has a throttle on the right for instant acceleration. The headlight is not super bright but it's good enough to see a few feet in front of you in the dark. To start riding the bike, first we turn on the power button on the battery. Next, we can use throttle or pedal assist to start the bike. In pedal assist level 1, the motor will help to boost your speed up to 3 to 5 mph. This is really good for casual riding or commute. Pedal assist level 1 is probably my most used level. In level 1, I can get a boost from the motor that's good enough to start my bike from start. Then I will switch to higher gears and pedal to get some exercise. It's a very useful mode when riding in urban area because we usually have to stop at every intersection. In pedal assist level 2, the motor will help to boost the speed up to around 8 to 9 mph. It's the mode I will use when I have to go through some unpaved roads or grassy areas or some snow hills. In level 3, the motor will boost up to around 10 to 15 mph. I can also reach the top speed of around 20 mph after unlocking the speed limit. This is useful when you are trying to catch up with others or climbing large hills. I do feel the front suspension is a little bit soft, but it does improve the riding experience by reducing the shake on bumpy roads. The walk mode comes very handy when you have to push the bike. Keep in mind that a large battery pack usually weighs 10 pounds or more. This really helps when you have to move the bike into a garage or across the intersection. If you want to try out e-bikes but don't want to spend thousands of dollars on your first bike, remember to give e-bikes from Vivi a try to see if they fit your need.